We have until now discussed Scrum's approach to risk management in detail. Let us complete this chapter with a discussion on how risk management in Scrum is different from the traditional ways of managing risk in a project. Scrum versus traditional project management. We know that Scrum and most of the traditional project management methods define risk as uncertain events that could positively or negatively affect the achievement of project objectives. And also that the procedure for managing risk is quite similar. That is, risks are identified, assessed, mitigation actions are planned, implemented, and communicated continually. Then what differentiates Scrum's approach to risk management from that of a traditional project management method? Let's have a look. In traditional project management methods, the emphasis is on detailed upfront planning to identify and assess risks as well as to determine risk responses for all the identified project risks. During project execution, any project team member can identify risks and the project manager or the project management office or project support staff can update them in the risk log or risk register. The project manager regularly monitors and controls all risks and usually assigns specific individuals in the team to take responsibility for managing different aspects of risk. In Scrum, any Scrum team member or external stakeholder can identify risks and the product owner can update the identified risks in the risk-adjusted prioritized product backlog. The Scrum principles of empirical process control and iterative development enable the Scrum team to constantly keep identifying risks and adding them to the prioritized product backlog, where such risks are prioritized with other existing user stories in the backlog to be mitigated in subsequent sprints. The Scrum team has collective responsibilities for managing all risks for the sprint. The difference is that Scrum emphasizes collective ownership and management of risks, whereas traditional project management methods stress on individual accountability. Also in Scrum, as it believes in empirical process control, there is less importance for detailed upfront planning, which saves resources that can be invested in more productive activities. This concludes our session on risk. Thank you for learning with us.